Before, local wisdom lay in people's sayings and idioms. Now, a lot of people take memes as some nuggets of wisdom. And while the Jelvix team takes memeology seriously, analyzing various frameworks is an even greater passion of ours. This time, we decided to combine these two passions. We'll have a look at the two PHP frameworks, Yi and Laravel, from the standpoint of memes to figure out how accurately they depict them. We're Jelvix, a software development partner for industry leaders. We post weekly videos on tech in five minutes. Don't forget to subscribe and use the super thanks feature to support our channel so we can deliver more great content. Let's take a look at a meme that was the first one to ignite the curiosity of the Jelvix team. Most probably, what it tries to convey is the aspect of framework's popularity. While Yi appeared in 2006, which is five years before Laravel, the age factor did not give the framework a competitive edge. Jelvix team came across the similar tech statistics mentioning Yi and Laravel, and they don't have a big market gap between each other. Currently, Laravel is adopted by 10,000 websites more. Judging from Google Trends, however, the gap between them looks much bigger, with Laravel outperforming Yi in terms of search interest by up to 30 times. And it gets even crazier. According to the developer survey, 50% of developers state they actively use Laravel compared to only 9% mentioning Yi. So why does Laravel seem to have greater growth dynamics as a framework? Is it the performance, the ease of use, or any other factor? Jelvix team is eager to dig deeper. First, Jelvix developers presume Laravel is so high in demand framework for businesses due to its rapid deployment capacity. Time is money, and Laravel seems to understand that better than anyone else. Laravel's code generation tools and built-in features speed up development and simplify server and deployment management. Now, that does seem like a dream for impatient business owners who crave fast ROI. But what about Yi? Jelvix developers working with Yi mention there is a range of tools helping them to accelerate development just as fast as Laravel. Some of them include simplified code generation, efficient caching mechanisms, and RESTful API development for scalable solutions. Yi is known for its performance, which can contribute to faster response times and efficient deployment. And besides, it also offers automatic default routing, which positively impacts Yi's convenience, flexibility, performance, and security. As it looks, both Yi and Laravel are capable of rapid deployment when used effectively by skilled developers. So maybe the game changer here might be usability. The Jelvix team kept on investigating. So here you go, another meme gets discovered. Does it have a grain of truth in it? Well, definitely. Laravel Jetstream is a robust pre-built application scaffolding for Laravel that is designed to streamline common development tasks and provides a set of tools to help developers build web applications more efficiently. Some of these tools include Tailwind CSS, Livewire, Inertia, support for multi-tenancy, and team-based collaboration. But wait, maybe Yi has its analog of Laravel Jetstream too. Well, it doesn't. In Yi, you would typically need to set up such features manually or use available extensions or modules to achieve similar functionality. So Laravel is an obvious winner here. Now let's look on a bit of the darker side, such as potential risks and issues related to updates. How do Laravel and Yi perform in this aspect? And is there some obvious winner in this category? Yi is known for its strong backward compatibility, which can make updates smoother for projects adhering closely to Yi conventions. Therefore, Laravel updates may require more extensive testing and adjustment especially for complex, highly custom projects. Now, an interesting observation by Jelvix. Laravel tends to have more frequent updates compared to Yi. Laravel has a release cycle that typically introduces a new major version every six months, plus minor updates in between. And more updates means more bug fixing, right? 
Meanwhile, Yi is believed to focus on stability and backward compatibility, having fewer but less disruptive updates. Its last major update, Yi 2.0, was released back in 2014. But who knows, maybe Yi 3.0 will be coming soon. Finally, let's review documentations and evaluate learning curves. While both Yi and Laravel have strong documentation resources, Laravel's documentation is more praised for its readability and richness of content, such as Laracasts, a learning space with many video tutorials. So to sum up, while Yi's G and Laravel's Jetstream serve similar purposes in helping developers streamline application development, they are distinct tools tailored to their respective frameworks. Ultimately, your choice should depend on your specific project case. Check out the list of industries where one framework is preferred over the other to get a better perspective. But that's all for now. We hope you liked our video. And actually, we've got more. Watch the battle between Laravel, Symfony, and Code Igniter wrapped up in an interactive format. Also, support us by liking this video and leaving a comment. And don't forget to subscribe and press the bell button. Bye for now.